to understand the spatial orientation test stand about heading and RVI, really they build it. Okay, so first let us understand what is heading or zydo heading. So we can make a sign like this. We know the north is always at the top. This is right angle to the north, Mainke degu. From north, if you come 182 degrees, you get south. From south, you get 270 degree, you get west. And from west, if we go another 90 degree, that means 360 degree, you come the north again. So north is 000 or 360. If is 090, south is 180, and west is 270 degree. Okay, so you have to understand like this. Always the north is at the top. So let's understand this in this first sense. The Zydo says west. Like, okay, take this for the Zydo says east. So any F graph, which one is on the east direction? Now, if you make a sign like this, this is not. Mankadegli, east is here. So the direction of the aircraft, business, easterly direction. So this is how you have to understand the aircraft is in easterly direction. Okay. Now, let's so when we talk about RVI, what is RBI? RBI is relative bearing. Relative bearing. What is that? All right, energy. What is that? Let's say it. This is your station. Okay. This is your VR station. Or this is your airport. Airport. Because you're in the very, you know, initial stage. So try to understand this is the airport. And here is an aircraft. It's going this way. Here is an aircraft, it's going this way. Here is an aircraft, it's going this way. Here is an aircraft, it's going this way. Oh. So everybody wants to know what is my airport? What is the nearest airport? Well, this guy has the cockpit indication of the UL indication and his needle will show towards the airport. His needle will show towards the airport, okay? His maiden renal is show towards the airport. His maiden also will show towards the airport. So everybody's middle will show towards the airport, irrespective of where they are going, which direction they're going. Okay. So from here, you can understand where it is my airport. If you are in the cockpit, if you're in the cockpit, your laden will show on the way towards the airport. So now you see this aircraft, its heading is not 000. This aircraft heading can be 045. That means in between north and east. 045. This aircraft can have a heading of, you know, uh, between south and west. This is southwesterly direction. So it can have the heading of, let's say, uh, this EF curve can have a heading of 0451050 between north and east, north this direction. So the direction of the aircraft can have anything, but the needle will always show the airport. Uh, what is a relative bearing? Relative bearing is from the nose of the aircraft or the four, four, four and a half axis of the aircraft. I can see this is the nose of the aircraft. If you go light angle, okay. If you go right angle, the measurement of the angle is your relative bearing. So you see, you come here, this is 180 degree plus, let's say this is 30 degree. So your relative bearing here is 210 degree. From the nose of the aircraft, what is the relative bearing, which is in our calculate always clockwise? Okay, clockwise, clockwise. You cannot go anti clockwise. So, from here, what is the relative bearing? 
velocity bearing from the nose of the aircraft let's say this is right angle so this can be 35 degree okay this can be 35 degree is the relative bearing okay so if you understand this much now try to solve any of the question first from the zyder you can see what is the heading of the aircraft is easterly direction so you know where which side is east where is the nose this is east so this option is easterly direction okay we find out now find out the rba now rba what it says from the nose of the aircraft you see this image from the nose of the aircraft here is your station right the pointer is pointing towards this side so here is your station or airport airport so from the nose of the aircraft if i take from the nose of the aircraft 90 degree 180 degree 270 degree so from the nose of the aircraft i have to go 270 degree i will get the airport so you see this is 30 60 90 120 180 and west is 270 degree 270 degree so your relative bearing is 270 now 270 if you identify is not enough 270 is when your nose is at the north when your aircraft is pointing to north from there you have to go 270 degree so you will have to go here in this segment you will have to go north plus 270 degree you will gig your airport now in this situation your aircraft nose is not actually north it is in the east so what you will have to do you will have to east plus this much okay east plus n plus 270 that means east is 090 plus 270 it will come 360 so actually your aircraft is this side 090 heading and you will have to find out 360 degree where your station is now come to this image this is not always in this image so anywhere you 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 have to scan and anywhere you ha you have to find out this 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 position these other positions you have to find out 360 degree which side is the airport this airport so if you stand over here what where is your 360 here do you get the airport no you are standing here can you get the airport no you are standing here can you get the airport no you are standing here can you get get the airport yes yes i can get the airport standing here five so my answer will be five so understood let's see what is the answer here the answer is five three is not the answer so this is how you have to find out the relative bearing in your carrot pilot program they shall spatial or impatient question will be there okay so if you want to learn in detail a vector cloud dot com thank you